hello everyone today i want to show you how to solve this problem for the values of c if we have c minus 1 to the power of c is equals to 1024 and here our c should must be an uh, positive number okay so our c is uh, must be an positive number uh, so it means that we solve this problem for the positive value of c uh, now I hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. Now first we need to find the prime factors of 1024 uh, for this we uh, just use here this division technique to find the prime factors of uh, 1024. So now first we divide this value by 2 and you get here 2 5 is a 10, 2 1 is a 2 and 2 2 is a 4. We gain divided by 2 and we get a 2 to the 4. We carry 1, it will become 11. 2 5 is a 10, again carry 1, it will become 12. And 2 6 is a 12. So we gain divided by 2 and we get a 2 1 is a 2, 2 2 is a 4, and carry 1. 2 8 is a 16. So we again divide it by 2 and we get a 2 6 is a 12, 2 4 is a 8. And we have 2 3 is a 6, 2 2 is a 4. We again divide it by 2, 2 1 is a 2, we carry 1 and 2 6 is a 12. So we again divide it by 2 and you get here 2 8 is a 16. So we divide it by 2 and you get 2 4 is a 8, 2 2 is a 4 and 2 1 is a 2. So it means that you see here this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. It means that uh, 1024 is equals to 2 to the power of 10. So now we need to replace this 1024 equals 2 to the power of 10 so that our above equation is written as uh, c minus 1 to the power of c is equals to 2 to the power of 10. And now you focus in the left hand side and you see here uh, the base is uh, 1 subtracted by its exponent. This means that is if our exponent is c then base is c minus 1. If our exponent is 10 then base is 10 minus 1. So now we need to make this type of condition in the right hand side. Uh, so here we need some working to make this type of expression in the right hand side so that uh, for this we need to break this 10 and we write this 10 as 2 times of 5 and now we uh, here we apply the exponent law you know about this law if we have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so if you have two numbers are multiplied by each other so we move any one number inside the term uh, and it will be written as this is uh, this will become c minus 1 to the power of c is equals to here this will be written as 2 to the power of 2 and its whole power is 5 and now further in the next step we have this is c minus 1 to the power of c is equals to this is 2 square and 2 square equals to 4 and it is 4 to the power of 5 and now here further in the next step uh, we need more simplifications uh, and now here uh, we uh, we just rewrite this 4 as in this form we write 4 as 5 minus 1 to the power of 5 and now uh, you see here on both of the sides we have the base is 1 subtracted by its exponent uh, so here we are ready to compare both of the sides so if you compare the bases then you get c minus 1 equals to 5 minus 1 and if we compare the exponents then you get c is equals to 5. So from both of these cases uh, so in the first case we easily get the value of c is equals to 5 but here in both of these cases you get the same answer that is c is equals to 5. And now here uh, for uh, in the next step we need uh, to verification of this value of c and here we check that is this value of c is satisfied our given question statement or not so that uh, now we need uh, to copy down given question statement here and it is c minus 1 to the power of c is equals to 1024 
uh, and now here we put this value of c equals 5 in the left hand side and it will be written as this is c minus 1 to the power of c and uh, we can write here our c is equals to 5 and it will becomes 5 minus 1 to the power of 5 is equals to 1024 so that now we check here is both of the sides are equal or not so we need some working in the left hand side and we have 5 minus 1 and we write 5 minus 1 equals 4 to the power of 5 is equals to 1024 and now we again write uh, the base of this term uh, as this is 4 we write it as 2 square and its whole power is 5 is equals to 1024 uh, and now here we again apply the exponent law so according to this law we multiply these two exponents and it will be written as 2 to the power of 10 is equals to 1024 and in the start of the problem uh, we see here 2 to the power of 10 is equals to 1024 is equals to 1024 so this shows that uh, the value of c is equals to 5 is satisfied over this given question statement uh, and this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos